time for the love talk of the day. I'm sure many of you remember that old uh, R&B song called Love Changes. Um, well, it does. Um, I remember the things that me and Warren did. We uh, stayed in this uh, this apartment, this little apartment in um in, in LA, it was on Sunset. It was before we had Krista. And there were certain things that we would do that were our normals. Um, we would order from this restaurant and always have these sandwiches and chips and soup and watch um, shows. But our life changed um, dramatically, you know, with kids and church and, you know, the music business growing and all the other things. So our normals changed and the requirements from each of us changed with what we had to do, how we had to make sure we uh, made it a priority for some people. It may feel like eh, you have to put your relationship on schedule. Yes, I actually do because so many things are coming in. So I have to block time off and say I'm intentionally spending time with my husband or my kids or my mom or my mother in love, whatever it is. Um, love has to change and shift as you grow. So don't write off a relationship because you say you've changed. If you've been together for some time, you should. You should change. You should grow. You should operate differently. You should be able to articulate your emotions a little bit better as you move on. You shouldn't be as shy and quiet and reserved. You shouldn't be as uh, uh, inhibited when it comes to expressing how you feel. You shouldn't be afraid to express how you feel. Well, I don't want to say that because they may get mad and da 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 whatever your dot, dot, dot is, because everybody has a dot, dot, dot that we can't really explain. But if you embrace the fact that love changes and that you change, sometimes even what you're looking for changes. Maybe you had a list of what you wanted at 20. Well, at 42, it may be different or even 62. It may be different. Be okay with that and allow yourself to embrace something new in your relationship or wherever you are in your phase and stage of love in your life. It is okay to shift and grow. It is okay to not do the same things that you did in past relationships. Well, she just didn't like this. And the next person, we going to do this because this is what love means. Well, that's dumb. Because if it didn't work once, you need to reevaluate it and assess it. And everybody is different and everybody may not embrace the same thing. Even if you're in a blended family and you're used to doing one thing and you and, and they don't do the same thing you do. It's shift. Love changes. Love grows. Love endures. Love is patient. Love is kind. You know, love suffers long. Love isn't puffed up. Love, love doesn't point out the bad just for the sake of pointing it out. You know, allow love to change and shift and change and shift with it. Okay, that's my love talk for the day, ladies and gentlemen.